Welcome to this episode of Banter by the Blender. This is an episode on fasting. It's going to be a quick episode on the topic of not eating, otherwise known as fasting. I'm currently on day four of a particular cleanse called Prolon, which gives you five packets of food to eat each day. It's a very small amount of food. It includes a special drink and some soups and some olives. And it's a great way to fast. It's very easy on the system. I feel pretty good. I occasionally feel hungry, but I haven't felt starving. It's a great experience to have. And you might say, well, comedy, how is comedy similar to fasting? It's because it's all about timing. So you might be wondering, why would someone like me, I don't have a particular big figure, why would I want to fast? And I have to tell you, the main message I want to get across here is that there's something special that happens when you fast. And if you haven't done it, it's something you need to witness with yourself. We have these extraordinarily bodies that are capable of so much. And we have these different states of being. And one of them is the fasting state. Since we live in such a luxurious life where we get to eat every day as much as we want, practically, we have different problems than we used to have. So we have to just choose a time to do fasting when the time is right. And because we experience the benefits. If you don't fast, you might think, well, I need food for energy or I don't want to feel terrible. And those are all legitimate concerns. But what I'm trying to say is that there is a transformation that takes place when you go through this. And part of it is just witnessing what your body is capable of, that we have energy storage in our system that allows us to deal with times we don't have food. And if you don't know how that works, you may get into bad mentalities about food. You may not understand if there isn't food available, what's going to happen. So this is, I think, a really important experience for everyone to have, no matter what your, your weight is, or if you, most people do it to drop a few pounds, it's also great for resetting your food habits. Because when you end the, cla the cleanse and the fast, you can go choose what type of food that you want to eat from here up. So for all of these reasons, cleansing and fasting are really useful. And just keep in mind that all of this stuff it's a lifelong journey and when it's involved with fasting, maybe it's a journey instead of to the fridge, you're going to the tea kettle because you do have to drink a lot, a lot of teas. And that concludes this episode 